Good morning. Just saw my second rainbow of the day. This one's just outside the front of work. The other one was on my way here. I tried to take pictures of it, but I don't know if it worked out. All right, it's Wednesday. That means we're halfway there to the weekend. I don't know what I'm doing this weekend. Kind of not sure. Plans are sort of up in the air. I have a pretty good idea what I'm doing next weekend, though. And that's going to be, wow, the middle of November already. What is going on? I'm excited. I like this time of year, but man, it's going past way too fast. It's going to be Thanksgiving in a couple of weeks. It's going to be Christmas in a little over a month. What? I don't get it. Where did all this time go? Wow. Seriously, when are these customers going to learn that I know what I'm talking about? If I tell you something, I'm not just making it up. Don't insist that I'm wrong and you're right when you are absolutely wrong. When you have no idea what you're talking about. It's amazing how fast your day can go from okay to blah. I'd like to go to 1994 and go to a Cranberries concert. Could really go for some of that right now. I'm not really liking 2015 at the moment. Oh, to be 21 again. I just realized that's half of my lifetime ago. You could fit two 21-year-old me's in me. I've somehow managed to drop a couple of notches below melancholy today. Or at least this afternoon. Sometimes people can just bum the heck out of you. And there's nothing you can do about it. Well, I'm gonna try. Hopefully, going home, seeing the puppies and the kitties. Hopefully, that will cheer me back up. Or at least lift me back up those couple notches that I dropped. Maybe watching more Walking Dead will get me out of my funk. Because at least I don't have dead people trying to eat me. Please clouds, bring your sweet, sweet puffiness to my rescue. I could really go for some Harvey's right now. A nice thick juicy burger some onion rings or even some of their fries I love their fries if you don't know what Harvey's is look it up it's Canadian I don't think they have any here in America oh Canada my home and native land I could really go for a salad right now too but one from Red Brick Pizza. But for some reason, everybody chased them out of Arizona. There are no more Red Brick Pizzas in Arizona. Well, it's definitely nice to be home. And Lucy's kisses and snuggles always make things feel a little bit better. Sometimes a lot better. Like today, a lot better. She knows just what to do, just what I need. Willow too, she's a big goofball. Aren't you Willow? They're just relaxing right now since it's so nice out. Sunny, cloudy, nice combination. Breezy, cool, not too cool, and definitely not hot. Just gonna wander around in the backyard for a while. Get the wind beneath my wings. Well, time for some chicken pot pie, some naan bread, and walking dead. I think that's a good combination. 
a little bit of Sierra Mist. Where'd the puppies go? The puppies went to bed. What is Willow's deal? She's always putting herself to bed early. Like, not even four o'clock early. They need to come out here and keep me company. This chicken pot pie's got one thing going for it. It's pretty disgusting looking. Hopefully it tastes better than that looks. It's a crustless chicken pot pie. I don't know what brand. But the non-brand looks good. I got some salsa here too. So maybe I can jazz things up with some salsa autentica. Huh? What's an autentica? It's a little on the well, it's past medium, so maybe it'll spice things up. Well, it's time I stop talking about how long this hair is getting and actually do something about it. Shazam! Just like that, it's all gone. It, I know. I get carried away. Don't be too sad. The beard is gone, too. Now you can see my double chin. I got uh, a little carried away. I came a little too far down on the sides and then it just got out of hand. I didn't mean to take the beard. I wanted to keep that for a while. So that will probably mean that I won't shave again until after the new year at some time. I never meant to grow it anyways. I'm just really lazy when it comes to shaving. So. It's all gone. Hair's gone, which is a good thing. I needed to get rid of that. But all of the beard is gone. I'm probably gonna have to do some touch up. So I always mess a few hairs here and there, maybe a small clump or a hair or two or a patch. But I think this time I did a fairly decent job, except for shaving the beard off. That's weird, I'm actually kinda sad about it. I didn't think I would be. Yeah, I was not planning on doing this. Oh man, you look so strange. I've grown the beard back. All right, that's it. I'm going to watch some more Walking Dead and call it a night. I will see you, when will I see you? Thursday, it's Thursday. Or tomorrow's Thursday. Or right now, while you're watching this, is Thursday. Or you're watching this months from now. Who knows? Give me a thumbs up for the new haircut and the loss of my beard. Feel free to donate money to its regrowth fund. And uh, subscribe, and you can see it grow back. We'll see how long it takes. Maybe by Christmas I'll have a little bit of a bushiness. All right, talk to you later.